Aaron, when you look at the shortstop competition, organizationally, is there somebody that you get a sense that you know you guys really want to win that job, or is it truly a wide open competition amongst those four guys, basically? Yeah. Um, I, I'm really excited about you know penciling any name of what they could be for us this year. Um, you know, obviously we got a taste of, of Peraza last year at the end of the year, coming off a pretty strong season at AAA. Um, you know, it was my first time really getting to be around him a lot. I thought he acquitted himself really well. Um, certainly strengthened his position going into the winter, I think. Um, I think IKF's had a really good winter, and I think uh, year two here um, could be even better for him. Um, obviously, Anthony, we're we think is going to be a great player in this league. Um, and then Oswaldo, we know, can can play the position as well and has had some success up here. So, um, I, no, I don't think there's any way that I'm hoping it necessarily goes. You know, you like it to declare itself, I guess, on some level. But you like for the guys to continue to make it hard because you feel like they all bring something potentially special to the table. Um, so we'll let that kind of play itself out. Um, you know, I, I, I certainly don't, you know, when we say competition, you know, this, for me, it doesn't become about a, this guy hit 311 in spring with two homers and this guy hit, like, it's not necessarily all about that. Obviously, performance always matters. and um, But hopefully, you know, maybe it'll declare itself about who is the best guy. Uh, to be in that spot uh, when we break camp, and 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 in the end, we feel like whatever way it goes, there's a few really good options there. So uh, we'll let that play out, and and not only just this spring, but it, maybe it's something that plays out throughout the entire year as well. Will it be difficult? I'm sorry. Did, will it be difficult to get all four of those guys enough reps? I would imagine you don't want it to go down to the last three or four days of the spring before you make a decision. Or uh, I don't think so itself. because, you know, you know, they'll play other positions too, you know, all of them. Um, so, you know, try and get them regular, you know, playing time, you know, look at them as, you know, we're getting them ready for their season to – you know, and, and so that's about getting at bats and getting reps and logging innings and getting built up and things like that. So um, hopefully we can do that creatively by by using all those guys in some different positions at times. So you may see them on the same field, same in the same lineup on a given day uh, on the field together. So um, no, I'm not too worried about that. Assuming everyone's healthy and uh, you know uninterrupted springs and things, I'm not too worried about that. Chris. What do you need to see out of Volpe for him to have a legitimate chance of making the team by the end of the camp? I don't know. I, I mean, I don't know specifically how to answer that. Like, um, you know, if, if, if I feel like or, you know, he looks like the best option or like he's ready to go do this, you know, then – the, you know, we wouldn't be adverse to doing that. Um, but I don't think there's a, he's got to do this, this, and that. It's, you know, you kind of watch and it'll show itself.